everyone, I am Ravi Handa. Welcome to another video on percentage. In a class, 60% of these students are girls and the rest are boys. Okay, so let's say that girls are 60x whereas boys are the remaining 40x. Now we are given that there are 30 more girls than the boys. How many girls are more than the boys as per our equation? R, as per our equation, 20x are extra, which is given to me as 30. So that gives me the value of x as 1.5, which will mean there are 90 girls, there are 60 boys, or a total of 150 students. This is the composition of the class. If 68% of the students pass, which means 68% of 150 have passed, if it was 100, then the 68 students would have passed. It is 150. So 68 plus half of 68 or 68 plus 34 or a total of 102 students have passed. If 102 students have passed, how many students have failed? 48 students or the remaining 150 minus 102, 48 students have failed. We are given that 30 boys have passed. From 60, 30 boys have passed. That means 30 boys have failed. Now, total passing students is 102, out of which 30 are boys. That means the remaining 72 who have passed are girls. Very similarly, 48 students have failed, on, out of which 30 are boys. So the remaining 18 must be girls. So 18 girls have actually failed. What am I asked? The percentage of girls who do not pass. So how many do not pass? 18 do not pass out of a total of 90, which is nothing else but one fifth of the girls have not passed. Or we can say 20% of the girls have not passed or 20% will be my answer here. Hope you learned something from this video. Thank you. Please remember to subscribe to our YouTube channel and press the bell icon to get notifications of future videos.